let's talk about uh let's talk about uber and Domino's. i got a i got a pretty interesting uh take on this particular story so uh, yeah, we'll go uh, through it real know, quick uh, and then i'll uh i'll talk no, about I, my, I think, my interesting I, you know, take you know we talk about show me the money right so Domino's is going to get bombarded with a lot more Uber Eats, but then they're not going to send the orders to Uber Eats drivers. They're going to use in-house drivers to, you know, ship those Uber Eats orders out. So, hey, go check it out. Show me the money. Here's another idea. Go get a, you know, driver job at Domino's and collect the tips. And I'm sure they have some min wage. And Chris knows about this because he's done some pizza delivery. You know, just for an article or a content, I may just try that for a month. Let's see how it works. I mean... They're going to hire a whole bunch of drivers. If you're sick and tired of driving people around, you know, they may even give you a car because they have a deal with with, with uh, Chevy Bolt. Uh, they're buying, investing electric cars. So give it a shot. You may make more money than rideshare driving until it picks up. So I, I'm, I'm all for it. I may even go look into it. <laughs> yeah, and it, it's funny. So, I mean, yeah, I did uh, pizza delivery for eight years. And honestly, it was it wasn't bad. I was making um, you know above minimum wage for a wage for hourly. I was working full time, sometimes overtime, um, and then on top of it, I was making tips. Uh, yeah. So, and you know, I, I was one of the better drivers. So I would be taking you know probably double the amount of deliveries that you know other drivers were taking for the same night. So let's say I was working on a Saturday night, I might have you know 20, 25 deliveries that I took. Uh, the next driver might have, you know, 12 or 14 um, just because I knew the area. I knew how to how to maneuver and all that. And I was making banks. So, um, I mean, pizza delivery is no joke. It could be pretty good. And so I was talking to a friend of mine who owns uh, a pizzeria um, and he was talking about how um, so many drivers and, and just workers aren't there anymore. Every time I go there, there's a help yeah. wanted sign. I'm like, hey, look, if you need a hand or something, um, yeah. I know the business very well. Um, you know, it's, it's the same pizzeria. It's just that he opened that, that particular location. And, um, so I said, I told him, I'm like, Hey, if you need a hand, let me know. Um, but he was also saying how everybody's going to DoorDash and working DoorDash instead, because it's like, why work at one place when you could just go on and off whenever you want yep. and all that. And it's like, yeah, it makes sense. But the, on the other, the flip side, it's like, I could make more working a shift at that pizzeria than you know going out because they're hiring at 17 bucks an hour you're making 17 dollars an hour plus you're going out and getting tips even if you don't have any deliveries you're still making 17 an hour yeah, and i mean it's like i i'm i'm bewildered at that as plus yeah. your tips i mean if you're do i don't know what what that particular location was doing but i mean you know i would make on a saturday night 150 200 easily in cash i mean yeah. i'd work 40 hours i'd make 600 700 easily in cash um yeah. when it came to, to entire an entire week and that was yeah. before pay uh like the pay itself yeah. so i mean like right there it, it was well worth it um yeah. i mean, I, mean it, I don't it, know no i mean it says here right it says domino's is betting a partnership with uber east to turn around its pizza delivery business the chain just needs one thing to make it happen. Delivery drivers. There you go. So the pizza restaurant yeah. announced its agreement with Uber Eats earlier this month. Selling pizzas through Uber represents a billion dollar opportunity for the company. So there's going to be selling ton more pizzas. But Domino's has struggled to recruit delivery drivers for years, CEO said. Um, that means it will need to step up hiring and keep drivers to make good on its Uber Eats orders. The chain has made changes into training. As well as added company cars, you don't even you may not even need your car if you go to a location that offers you the car. Mm -hmm. Added company cars at some Domino's location, including electric vehicles, as we know, you know Chevy Bolts, so that workers who don't have cars can still make deliveries. And you know, I mean, I, I think it's worth a shot. I think you guys, if you guys are tired of gamification, gamblification, man, you just go there, pick up the pizza, deliver, come back, and do it again. And it may be, you know, yeah. change your pace or whatever. But I think uh, something not only that, out. not uh, you know what? If I was if I was working back at the pizzeria, I would have loved to probably have like ride share going. I mean, this yeah. is well before I stopped. I stopped driving in 2012 yeah. uh, or I mean 2013. And that was before Uber and Lyft even came around to the area. Um, 
but if if rideshare was was a thing back then, I probably would have done it. And then you know when when that shuts down, when I would have closed up, I would have just turned on the app and started driving. So yeah. uh, I would have made even more money at that point. So yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean, hey, it's it's a real possibility. I mean, if you're interested in it, it's it's definitely something. I mean, the way some rates are going in some places when it comes to to wages and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, it can be a real thing. I don't know how Domino's pays though when it comes down to it. Um, oh well, I'll, you know, I'm gonna go figure it out. There's working. so many Domino's. There's so many Domino's around. Yeah. Me. I'm gonna go talk to a manager. I go, I, I deliver for Uber Eats. Uh, what you got going here? And then let me see what it is. Yeah, no big deal. I'm nice. not ashamed. I'm not ashamed. I'm gonna go do it <laughs> for a month or two. This, whatever. The, this is this, right there. That's a perfect opportunity. You're a rideshare driver, a food delivery driver. You're already behind the wheel. You got the car. You hell you may not even need the car but yeah. you know you got the 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 car right there oh. so when it goes back to should you put on your resume yes yes yeah, you definitely. should <laughs> yeah. Yeah. all right thanks for watching that short little clip was from our live stream show me the money club with sergio and myself tuesdays 6 p.m eastern 3 p.m pacific make sure you subscribe turn on all notifications so you'll be notified when we go live as well as all of our awesome content Make sure to check out this video right here, which will take you to the entire live stream, or check out this video right there. All right, drive smart, everyone.